Hi, I'm Chris from GoProspectorStore.com. Today I'm going to be showing how to use a high banker for power sleeves. First thing you need to do is set up your pump. This is a 52 gallon a minute pump, which is plenty of water to operate a 10 inch high banker from GoProspectorStore.com. I have my suction, 2 inch suction hose in the water right now. And before we start, it's important to remember to prime the pump. Simply take the top cap off and pour a bucket of water into the top part. It only takes a few minutes. If you run the pump dry, you can damage the balloon. Put the cap on and you're ready to go. Now we're ready to start the pump. The next thing you need to do is set up the high banker. The ColdProspectorStore.com high banker is the only high banker that comes with a level gauge. This gauge helps you set the angle so you get the best gold recovery. Now it's time to put material into the hopper. I've been digging behind me, I've been putting it into a five gallon bucket, and now I can just dump it into the hopper. One of the beauties of a high banker is that you don't have to classify the material. The machine does the work for you. This is one of the beauties of a high banker. Just dump it in. It's time for cleanup. Simply stick a five gallon bucket underneath the end of the, the high banker. Open the riffle tray and lift up the riffles. The carpet will slide right into the five gallon bucket. Get all the material into the bucket. You're gonna be panning this out later. I can see that I have some fine gold caught in the, the rib rubber matting in the front of the box. I'll clean that up after I turn off the pump. And that's basically how you use a high banker. I'll take this bucket down to the stream and pan it out. This is where I should find my nuggets and thicker gold. For more information about high banking, please see www.goldprospectorscore.com.